Привет, друзья! Anatoly, the Soviet Super Saiyan here, with a little news video for y'all. I haven't done a news recap in a while, and I know a lot of y'all like him, so I figure we'd do one. Actually hop on it fairly timely for once. Before we go any further, if you like this kind of content, I'd appreciate a like or subscribe if you haven't yet. Really helps the video, helps my channel out. But with that being said, let's get into the news. First things first, a little update on the uh, thanks for three years Dragon Ball Legends third year anniversary. Uh, event if you want to call it, there's the login bonus that just refreshed today. And the only real important thing that I saw in here was chance time was done. Oh, well, the chance time one was done. If y'all weren't aware of it, the way that that worked is after you cashed in your tickets, you know, they chose three winning numbers and the first place got 500. The first place number was 55. Second place, if you had any picked on 64, you got 300, which I actually got that uh, prize. Only one, but I'll take 300 free CC. And third place was the 89 ball, and you got 100 for each one that you had on it. So, you know, you probably weren't that likely to get it, but free CC is always nice. Then, there's the Super Chrono Crystal Sale. Nothing new around this time, truth be told. It's the same as it's always been. Spent quite a bit of money. I think it's 40 some dollars. Let's go check real quick. Sorry, $41. And you get the 2000 Chrono Crystals and the Super Chrono Crystal. As far as I can tell, the only addition this time around is for three Super Chrono Crystals, you can redeem to get a copy of either Vegito Blue or LF Frieza. If you somehow have the $120 to spend on Super Chrono Crystals, but don't yet have a copy of them for the like three people in the world who that applies to. <laughs> but besides that, same as usual. And now we get into some of the, you know, new events and stuff in this update that I'm actually really excited for. This event that they already teased in the last video and stuff, Anniversary Surprise You, is pretty straightforward. There's a set of missions that you gotta go do, and if you clear them all out, you get an Anniversary Surprise You ticket. Now, you can go to the shop and get a, you know, full copy, 600 Z Power, of any character that was released from December 2020 and back. It's not just these 16 they have pictured there. It's literally any character that was released before 2021, you can get a copy of, uh, Sparkings that is. And honestly, I think that's really cool. If there's a character that you haven't gotten yet and you want to complete your collection, or you want to get that sixth star or that second red star, here you go. Here's a copy of whoever you want. So that's pretty dope. I'm personally actually might get that green Super Saiyan 4 Goku there just because mine's five star and I'm just like, ah, I want you a little higher for my GT team. Because honestly, I don't know if there's anyone from 2021 and earlier that I don't have a copy of yet, but we'll see. And there's also the, uh, the two rising battles that we have on now. The first one is you're not the only one who can do that, the Vegito one. And there's 25 stages. We currently have the first 15. You'll get 500 Chrono Crystals for doing it all. And if you beat Battle 25, you get the PvP message, sorry to be rude, but you left yourself completely open. If you complete all the missions, you get the prestigious title, the power to rival a deity. And I ain't gonna lie, that looks pretty, pretty dope there. I kind of like it. The stages also have a brand new equipment called Come On and Give Me Your Best Shot. Base critical five, uh, up to 12%. Second slot is base blast defense, five to 15. And the third slot is base blast attack, eight to 20 too, for all fusion warriors and I honestly am not a huge fan of base critical being a slot but the defense and blast attack if you're looking for a pretty offensively minded character that that's going to be really nice and there's also the counterpart for lack of a better word to it the for the good of the cosmos for creation event that hasn't started yet it'll start on the 21st of june it's pretty much you know the counterpart to it except you're fighting zamasu i'm assuming if you complete battle 25 there you get the pvp message for the good of the cosmos for creation and if you complete all the missions to it you get the prestigious title all consuming eternal shadow <laughs> Just as a little side, I love this prestigious title. It's like when $10 like handles of vodka have premium vodka on there just because there's literally no regulations to what it means. Like I, I don't blame them for it. Like I got a little marketer in me. I know how it works, but I just find it funny as hell. And then the exclusive equipment you get for these stages are you're still not a god for future and powerful opponent, which is nice because that covers, you know, a real wide base of characters. First slot's strike attack, five to 13%. Second uh, slot is base critical, five to 15%. And the third slot is five to 10% defense against Saiyans. Now, you know, I did say that it's usable by a lot of characters, but that's clearly why it's really not that powerful. I'll probably go out of my way to get one 
S rank of this equipment, maybe two just to have it as like filler ones, but I'm not super impressed by it. I honestly like the other one way more. And now there's one thing I'm sure that y'all have been waiting for, the banner review. Yeah, that's right. I know that y'all saw this, the Legends Ultimate pickup, but here's the thing. I, I already did a video real quick, a little YouTube short on my thoughts about it. So it'll be right up here, be in the description down in the comments if you wanna go see it. But if you don't, you know, have 50 seconds or so to go to watch a short, here's the long story short. My opinion, don't do this. It's not a bad banner, but it's so clearly bait that it's not even funny. So save your CC. My guess is we're getting a Zenkai to LF purple Vegito soon, and that's gonna be so much better than any of the LFs on this banner. Yeah, I know. Kid Boo and Rose haven't come back before this, and Broly's been relatively rare, but it ain't gonna be worth it. Whatever you spend on this banner, when LF Zenkai Vegito comes out, you're gonna be like, damn, I ain't gonna lie, dog. I wish I had that CC to spend on him instead, so you guys do what you want. I ain't gonna tell you how to live life, just my two cents. But that all being said, that's about all that was in this update. You know, pretty concise. We got a decent little bit of events, some more summons if you wanna blow your money there on that or the Super Chrono Crystal sale, but you know, if you made it this far in the video and you haven't yet i'd appreciate you throwing me a like really helps out the video helps me out and it's just honestly really encouraging to see and also if you've made it this far in the video and you haven't subscribed yet i gotta ask you why you clearly liked what you watched join the ussr and become a soviet saiyan today smash that subscribe button help us grow and stick around for a little shit posting but as all you guys who have been around for a while know i just love making these videos i love it anytime any of y'all turn out to check them out and until the next time I got one to drop for y'all, peace.